Hi, Treehouse folks, um, DIY enthusiasts and homesteaders. Uh, today we're going to be working on a greenhouse. Um, getting my truck ready here. <laughs> Always need a little bit of something. Um, we're going to get some tires. We got just a few right there. Um, we're going to need a lot more. This whole wall here is going to be six feet high, tire wall. And then it's going to taper down a little bit over here. And then probably be about two foot wall here and taper down. So um, it's going to be a greenhouse, and uh, that's facing south. Back up a little bit. Um, this is some of the site work. I had uh, dug it all out. Uh, I put the building right next to, uh, right across from the other, my other building, my shop there. And um, so they both face the same direction. And I dug it out, put it in. Crushed. Also uh, had a little extra stone, so I added to my little dooryard driveway there too. We'll look a little like this one. This uh, this side here being the, the window side, um, like it is now. That's my shop. Um, so it's going to look like that. It's going to be for chickens and uh, garden vegetables and some fruit trees maybe. Who knows what I'll put in there. Hopefully not a bunch of junk. Uh, hopefully I won't use it like storage. We'll see. We'll see. So uh, we're off to get some tires uh, next town over at a garage friend of mine. And Tires, I'm gonna make greenhouse. Greenhouse out of black tires. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got our precious cargo home, and we're ready to stack them up. We're gonna put them in different sizes, more or less. So as we're building the wall, we can uh, we can take from whatever pile we need in terms of width and thickness. So Paul, Yo. um, how many of these these uh, tire walls have you done before? Uh, at least a hundred. Really, a hundred? Well, maybe at least forty or fifty. Forty or fifty? Well, which is it? A hundred or forty or fifty? Oh, uh, twenty-five, maybe. I don't know. Oh, now it's twenty-five. <laughs> how many, Paul? Is this the first one, Paul? Yeah. I'm <laughs> Okay, well that's good. We're starting on the same I'm spot. Good, though. Though. <laughs> I got this. Okay, all I've right. Done things very similar. Not only that, I watched a YouTube video on this. I know I got this. I know I got this. I got this. Cut. <laughs> So the tires are for the foundation, but for the walls and the building itself, we need some dimension. Those logs that I had cut in the previous video um, from Paul's um, had my portable sawmill guy 
come break and cut out dimensional lumber, mostly 2x11s, 2x8s. Why was his uh, scope of the day? Grab the logs, bring them on the put them on the mill, taking the slabs off. The sawmill is really quite amazing. So I'll have a lot of uh, slabs there that I can use on the walls, sawdust pile I'll use for my chickens and for various other things. Um, I got uh, two full truck fulls of uh, dimensional lumber and boards and uh, all the stuff we hopefully need for the greenhouse. And uh, thanks for watching and stay tuned. Like and subscribe. Thank you.